Magandang hapon sa inyong lahat. Ipagpapatuloy natin ang discussion sa iba't ibang mga concepts na related sa ating aralin na may pamagat na mga isyong moral tungkol sa kawalan ng paggalang sa katotohanan. And for this recorded lecture, we will focus our attention to the concept or to the concept of secret or in Tagalog, lihim. So, let us define what is a secret first. So, a secret is a concealed or undisclosed information which is not known to some or to all and that is shared by a person to another. So, sa madaling salita, ang mga secrets or lihim ay hindi hayag. Hindi hayag sa lahat. Maaaring ito ay hayag lamang sa isang tao or sa ilang mga piling tao. Okay? And basically, Lahat tayo ay mayroong mga secrets na itinatago sa ating buhay. Now, the foundation of all secrets, especially yung pagsasabi ng ating mga sikreto sa ating kapwa, is on mutual confidence. Okay? Yung tiwala, yung trust sa mga pinagsasabihan natin to. Okay? So, kung kaya, halimbawa, pag kapag nag-share ako o nag-share kayo ng inyong secrets sa inyong kaibigan, you are doing it because you feel that your secret is safe dun sa tao na kung sa tao na pinagbahaginan mo ng iyong sikreto. Okay? However, secrets can be disclosed. Ihayag mo talaga. But in some instances, okay, may mga sikreto tayong nalalaman or na, na, na nalalaman natin through unjust means. Diba sa mga telenovela sa Pilipinas, yung bigla ka nakinig sa usapan, etc., etc. Now, the, the, the only just way for a secret to be communicated to you or to be known by you is when it is shared by another, by the person owning the secret. Now, all other means are unjust means of obtaining this secret. Now, Isa pa sa mga katangay na secrets is that you, when it is revealed to you, when it is revealed to you, you cannot just divulge the secret to anyone. Okay? Hindi mo basta ito pwedeng sabihin sa ibang tao. And if should you decide to tell it to other people, then it might cause harm to the person who shared the secret, it might cause harm to you, or it can even destroy the relationship between you and the person who shared the secret. Now, para mas maintindihan natin, ito yung paliwanag. So, secrets are shared because of trust. So, sa situation na ito, siya, okay, ibinabahagi niya yung kanyang sikreto sa isang tao because naniniwala siya, confident siya, that, that this person will not easily divulge the secret that he or she shared. So, the obligation the obligation to keep the secret to keep the secret a secret will be dun sa recipient nito kasi ibinahagi na niya sa kanya so ang responsibilidad na manatiling sikreto yung ibinahagi sikreto ay nasa tumanggap ng respeto na ito okay a secret must never be revealed so, when a person shared to you a secret, kahit pa yan ay napakaliit na sikreto, kahit pa yan ay tungkol lamang sa crush, kahit pa yan ay tungkol lamang sa gawa ng upit ng piso, you must not reveal a secret that was shared to you. However, okay, narito ha, unless there is a grave reason for doing so. Kinakailangan kung ibabahagi mo ang isang sikreto na ibinahagi sa iyo ng iyong kabarkada, kinakailangan may napakalalim na dahilan, may, may pangangailangan na malaman ng ibang tao ang sikreto na ito. Kung walang ganito, we must not reveal the secrets that were shared to us by our friends or by anyone. 